In James chapter 3, we find a remarkable passage concerning the tongue. In the 8th verse, the author writes, But none of mankind is able to tame the tongue. It is an uncontrollable evil. It is full of deadly poison. The fact that the author says this should not be a surprise to us. If we look back in our own lives, we can think of what people have said on television, what people have said in songs and music, and so on. How people blaspheme God, how they speak evil of others, how they speak with arrogance and pride, even though they ought not. And those of us who are Christians, we may be apt to thank God for the good things that happen. But do we also curse man? Do we also speak evil of others? That should not be the case. Verses 9 and 10 say, We thank God and the Father with it, and we curse men with it, those who have become according to the likeness of God. Thanks and cursing come out from the same mouth. My brethren, these things do not need to become so. Similar statements can also be found in Romans chapter 12, verse 14. There, the Apostle Paul writes about how to respond to those who are persecuting the Christians in Rome. He actually tells them to speak well of them, shockingly enough. Speak well of those who are persecuting you. Speak well and do not curse. Again, if we go to 1 Peter chapter 3, verses 8 and 9, we are provided instruction from the Apostle Peter about how the brethren should treat one another, how we should be like-minded, sympathetic, friendly, and so on. But we are also told that we are to not respond evil with evil. We are to not speak with reviling against those who revile us. Now to the end, be like-minded, sympathetic, loving the brethren, affectionate, friendly, not giving evil in exchange for evil, or reviling in exchange for reviling, but instead speaking well of others, knowing that you were called for this, that you should inherit a blessing. These words are challenging. It is not easy to speak well of those who persecute you. It is not easy to resist a reviler with something that is actually positive, something that is actually loving. But let us try to do that as best we can. Let us thank God and also thank our fellow man as best as we can and to not curse. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video and have a nice day.